This video will show you what you need to do to find copper in LEGO Fortnite. We're going to need a rare pickaxe. In order to have that, you'll need to upgrade your crafting bench to the blue rare tier. The pickaxe takes flexwood rods, which take flexwood to make at the lumber mill. In order to get flexwood, you need to use a rare forest axe on the cacti in the desert biome. It will also take three sand claws, which can be obtained from the light brown wolves in the desert biome as well. One of the items we're going to need is a snowberry shake made from two snowberries and one milk at the juicer. If you don't have the snowberry shake unlocked or the juicer, you can just get some snowberries from the colder areas uh, close to the cold biomes. We're also going to want to make the cool headed charm if we can. It will take three silk thread, one marble, and three sand shells. The sand shells are obtained from the crab like creatures in the desert biome specifically. Now on your way to the Dry Valley Desert Biome, you'll want to make sure you pick up some wood on the way unless you've collected some from your base before you left. We're going to use that wood to build what I would like to call scaffolding to once we actually get into the cave because some of the ore is higher up and hard to get to. So to find that item, we want to make sure we are heading towards the Dry Valley, which is this light brownish area up here just past the grasslands to the north predominantly. And you'll recognize it by those types of trees there and cacti and the light brown sandy biome ground. So once you're in the desert area, the dry valley, you're going to look around for the stone outcroppings like this. And you'll be able to know that it's a cave by this white symbol on the minimap. Just like the ones in the grasslands. And you'll go around and go inside. Once we're inside the cave looking for copper, we need to make sure that we have some heat resistance items on. We can use things like the cool headed charm as well as the snowberry shake. Once when we have those equipped so that we're not taking any fire damage, we can look around for copper. Here's some right here. It's this kind of like dark looking ore, I suppose you could say with like the little green elements and we can just start mining it with that rare pick. And there you go, drops copper, that's all you need to do.